I'll show you how to sew the strips onto our, our carpet. Um, I've already started sewing the strips on, as you can see. What you do is you take the folded strip that's already been cut and lay it, start right at that starting line, and lay it right along our one inch marker. If you want, you can put in pins to hold it in place and remove the pins as you sew. And then you put it on the machine using a, a normal stitch, a two and a half stitch um, length. And you want to sew like right about a quarter inch here on the edge. You're going to sew right along that fold and keep the edge right up to the, your line that's been marked. So start by backing up a bit. Now remember that you're using a heavy needle, a jeans needle, or a heavy duty needle, depending upon what your machine instructions call for. And remove the pins as you go. And continue down until the end. And then you sew on all of these strips in the same way, all folding flat in one direction. Now I'm going to show you how, what to do as your carpet gets longer and it gets more difficult to put into the machine. You'll want to roll the excess up like this. Roll this up to sew the next panel. Okay, that makes it a lot easier to manage. Okay, and the other thing that you can do is to turn, uh, when you get to the halfway point, we have about half the rug done, turn the carpet over, and now this part is going to be the part that goes under, and it's a lot more manageable. You just place your next strip going in the other direction so that they're all going the right way and continue.